Why aren't you on the carpet? I don't know. Most of me had no rice. David, I want you over here so you can see me. I know. It's the worst. I Guys, everybody should be on the carpet with your notebooks looking at me. We're going way too slowly right now. What are you looking for, David? David, do you need that right, right now? Over there. All you need is your notebook. Rory, thank you for your help. All right. Guys, we should have done the first one together. That was Mr. McLean's fault. That was, I mean, the, kind of the language was pretty difficult, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. All right. So somebody give me a definition of misdirection. Kaya. I said, me and my, me and my friend Marley said, we said, um, just guess the page is going to be um, We said, didn't you send me to my page? Guys, everybody should be on your page. All right, any other definitions for misdirection? Molly. Well, me and my partner Chris said a direction that was false. A good. Good. And Fakia. Me and my partner Larry said misdirection the wrong way. The wrong way. All right, good. And Marley, last one. Mine was kind of like um, thank you, except it said leading someone the wrong way. Leading someone the wrong way. Got it. All right. What did the author mean when he wrote upon the grounds of misdirection? Sophie. I wrote, the, the author means that the judge did not do something correctly. The judge did not do something correctly. That's a great answer. Leah. Can you share for the first one first, please? Uh, I think the author means the judge did not do something wrong. Good. And then for the second one, what argument did Judge Selden have with how Susan B. Anthony was treated in court? Kia. Yeah. Yeah, that's very good. Sophie. I had the same thing. I wrote Judge Selden had the argument of Anthony not having the jury. So guys, the. The, the thing that really tricked us, and I'll ask, I want Leah, tell me yours first. Mine was Judge Sheldon's argument was about how Susan B. Anthony should have a jury like everybody else. Perfect. So, what really confused us, which I should have realized this before we started, Judge Sheldon was not the judge on the trial. He was just stating what happened. Judge Hunt was the actual judge that was the one that gave misdirection of the trial, right? So th without that information, it was very hard to... Chris, Miss Barry's room, I don't want you drawing when I'm giving instructions. What is this paragraph mostly about? Jake. Um, this paragraph um, is mostly about how um, Susan was denied a fair trial. Um, so, and our and text states dot 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 the right of of a person charged with crime to have the question of guilt or innocence passed upon a constitutional jury, and that there was no I didn't finish, but and that there was no right, um, and that there was no power in the court for her to do deprive her right. You are ready for fifth grade. That was a great answer. Kia. Okay, can you say that one more time? Two o'clock this afternoon, 
Okay, do you think the main idea was about the giving the date of the trial, or was the main idea the fact that she did not get a fair trial? Okay. All right, one more. So, if you go ahead. I wrote this paragraph is mostly about how Judge Selden had an argument about CBC asking me to not have a jury. In the text, it says there is no right in, in the jury to brag about it. Skyler, Miss Ferry's class, you look like you're sleeping. You need to be paying attention. Go. Well, Chris is already in. That's okay. Uh, oh, well, Wright. go to Miss Wright's class. All right. Good job, everyone. That was pretty tricky. Let's try the next one together. All right. Miss Anthony on page 25. Miss Anthony answered and said she had a great many things to say and declared that in her trial every principle of justice had been violated, that every right had been denied, and that she had no trial by her parents peers, that the court and jurors were her political superiors and not her peers, and announced her determination to continue her labors until the quality was obtained, and was proceeding to discuss the questions involved in the case, when she was interrupted by the court with the remarks that these questions could not be reviewed. All right. Daya, tell me what declared means. Stated or insisted. Molly, can you tell me what principle means? Principle of justice. Rule of law. All right, what are our peers, Marley? People who are civil or old people. All right, determination. <coughs> Go ahead, Sophie. Decision. And obtain means? Leah? Error. All right, the first question, get ready to write. Why was Susan B. Anthony so upset by the way she was treated during the trial? Can somebody raise their hand and try to answer that? Brooks? Um, Susan B. Anthony was so upset by the way she was treated during the trial because um, she wanted to um, convince the, uh, the jury that this <coughs> what women were doing, uh, what they, that women didn't have the right to vote wasn't fair, but um, they they weren't they didn't have a jury for to help her to help support support her claim. So how so, can we simplify um, that? Could we say go ahead, Jake? Um, so I think that the reason that Cindy Anthony was so upset by the way she was treated during her trial was because that um, she uh, well she wasn't given a fair trial in the first place. So we could say. Susan B. Anthony was so upset during her trial because she did not get a fair trial to begin with. Does that sound good? Everybody should be writing right now. So we're going to restate the question. Susan B. Anthony was so upset. Perfect. Susan was upset. Susan was upset because she didn't get a fair trial. I said, I said, um, she was upset because she couldn't prove her right. Yeah, that's good too. So she didn't get her rights. Her rights were not carried out by the courts. She didn't get a fair. Jimmy, did you already do this section? If not, you should be writing this down. All right, the next question. What did the author mean when he reported that Susan B. Anthony said she announced her determination to hinder her labors until equality was obtained? That's a tough question. Leah? Maybe because she didn't get a fair trial because she didn't get a fair trial. Oh, um, uh, the author meant... Um, what, when he said, and I was, what the author meant when he said that, 
that he reported that Susan was all thin and sad. She did not feel emotions. Um, because. Do you want Jake to help you? Yeah. Um, so, um, um, when Susan B. Anthony said, well, she said, um, announced her determination to continue her labors until e equality was obtained. Um, so what she meant by that was um, she, she said that I'm not going to stop fighting for women's rights until it is allowed in this country. Basically. That is perfect. So what she's saying when she announced it is she's saying she's not giving up her fight to keep fighting for women's rights. That is a terrible sentence, though. So let's think about, Jay, can you repeat what you said again? Um, I said, so what What the author means by that is um, she said that she will not um, stop fighting for women's right to vote until that, qual until that quality was, well, that, until that was earned in the United States. So basically we can say is, she was going to continue to fight for women's rights to vote. The women's right to vote. Brooks, you want to add something or to she that? Could, or you could say um, she's not going to give up on the fight uh, for women's rights. Good. That's really good as well. Guys, after this, all we have to do is I just want to come up with the main idea of this paragraph, and then we're going to start... Our job. Yes, we can get our snacks when we I, when I dismiss you. Okay. Are we gonna do our jobs after this? Yes. Yeah. Leah, what's your question? Yeah. I wrote Mrs. Anthony inside that if she was going to continue to fight for women's rights to vote. All right. The main idea of this statement, the paragraph was mostly about. I think it was mostly about two things. Can you guys tell me, Marley, what do you think it's mostly about? I think this is mostly about, wait, so um, this paragraph right here. Yeah, the one we just read. Um, okay, so I think it's mostly about how she was in trial and she had nobody to support her decision, but it's not fair. So the first thing was, it was mostly about, this is really hard, because I really think that it was about two things. The first thing, what Jake said, it was mostly about how she didn't get a fair trial, right? And then the second thing was, what was she going to do after that, Jake? Continue fighting for women's right to vote. It was mostly about the fact that she didn't get a fair trial and that she was going to continue to fight for the women's right to vote. Got it? So the, when you're done, can you get Skylar out of the yeah. horse's eyes, please? Do we have to put, I mean, it's a main I'm idea statement, so should we put text evidence in it? It's so not, we, you I don't have to do it right now. Right. No, Miss, right. Right. Okay. Atiana, can I repeat what you said again, please? So the main idea was the fact that she did not get a fair trial, but she was going to continue to fight for the women's right to vote. in the middle room. If he is, tell him to come back in here, please. Thank you, Sophia. She didn't listen. He did listen. It's all right. All right. So, Jobs, we have 10 minutes. I know this is not much time. We have 10 minutes to complete our jobs and have a snack. Does everybody have a snack today? No. Yes. Yes. No, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. Leah, yes. All right, guys.
who who does not have a job? I have a job, but I just well, I have a job, but where it's something I mean, I have. have a job. All right, listen. If you've already done your job, Mr. McClain needs help from two people. You've already done your job, Daya. I'm eleven. Okay, good. So you can help me. I'm okay. Kia, what is your job? Um, computer monitors, but we need to understand when we're doing it, but we only do that when. Okay, so you can help me as well. Great. Brooks, also, I put the homework news up there for you. You know what to do with it. Okay. Guys, let's go quickly because we have 10 minutes to get everything done. First of all, it better be you. Well, I have a second. Second of all, it better be you. Second of all, it better be you. Second of all, it better be you. Thank you.